Hey folks, welcome back to Cocoon. Last time I was having some trouble with this puzzle where I need to be on this side of this, this bridge and get through the first gate and then have this button to press. And I was having some trouble figuring it out. Uh, after I stopped recording, I played around with it for a few minutes and then I realized while I can, while I can drop off the, uh, the bridge, I was having trouble with the idea that I can't get him to drop off the bridge, but in fact I can. So here's the solution I came up with. We place him right here above the touchpad. Then we remove the ball. So as soon as the bridge disappears, the quadruped like mecha or whatever that the ball gets into will drop onto the touchpad. So if I rush into this gate, and then we can get past. So there's the puzzle solved. Now we can lower the stairs and go get our little friend back and have him follow us. Okay, so with that done, let's proceed onwards. And here's our third Ooze Batman transport manta ray thing <laughs> for lack of a better term and after he flies us back all three of these will be on the the black stalks of goo so that should proceed us uh, that should allow us to proceed to whatever the next challenge will be whatever the next area will be Now there is, I guess, a fourth marble with the teleportation ability. I'm not sure if that's a fourth marble or not, but its I think it's something we need to acquire. Now that we have all three of these guys, this has popped up, and we can activate whatever this is. Flipping the dais to reveal something. Okay, it's a world hopper, a pad. Okay, so there's a fourth marble containing the first three. And a, wow, that is a big mo monster enemy type thing. I guess it's like a like a drill spider. I, I don't know what to call these things. <laughs> so now we have a fourth marble containing the first three. And the orange one has turned red for some reason. Plus it contains the drill spider, the enemy mob or boss that we'll, we'll need to defeat, presumably, at some point. Hmm, what do we do here? A lot of dead ends and Strange, like, plumes of smoke, white smoke, coming out of black orbs. I mean, everything in this world is so mysterious and unexplained. I guess I do really wish there was a little bit, expo uh, a little bit more of an explanation of what's going on. But I guess I'm not going to get that wish fulfilled anytime soon. So I'm trying to figure out where to go. All right, we've got a jump pad here. This is promising. Okay. So, so far this marble has not revealed if it has a special ability for traversal or puzzle solving. I guess we might find out in time. There's also, yeah, there's like particles in the air and a, and a wind stream blowing from right to left. That's kind of interesting. Something we haven't really seen before. Oh, okay. That closed behind me. That turned this into a staircase. And what did that do? It lowered it? Okay, we've got another another symbol puzzle. 
We've got the five symbols here, so I need to find a clue for the order in which I need to depress them. Not seeing anything so far. Anything that looks like the symbols that could be a hint for the order. Um, so if we pick this up, it does give off a little bit of light. Feels like we need to do something with this. It's like it, it, it turns that those columns invisible or in, impermeable, intangible, so we can pass through them, but I don't see how that helps me. We're stuck down here. Let me let me traverse the edges of this space while looking for the clue. Oh, there we go. Okay, so when I bring the light to illuminate, I can see inside these black orbs. So, there's like a pathway. Got it. Okay. So where does it start? I guess it starts here. All right, so it's butterfly, triangle. Which one is that? I guess, is that Pentagon or is that a new one? Went butterfly, triangle. I only see four. Oh, here's the fifth one. Okay. I guess that must be the Pentagon then? Yeah. Okay. Butterfly, Triangle, Pentagon. And then this was uh, Diamond Sandwich and then Hexagon? Okay. So, Butterfly, Triangle, Pentagon, Diamond Sandwich, and Hexagon. That should release... Our monodrone friend. So if the fifth marble has any real power at all, I guess you would call it illumination. Okay. There's our monodrone friend. So now we should be able to exit the way we came in, yes? Is that over here? Or where was that? Uh, I thought we came in over here somewhere. Is there a slope or... Yeah, 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 here we go. So we gained the monodrone and learned about the illumination trait of the fourth marble. Let's see what we can do with those two things. Well, that disappeared. Okay. Feels like we need to go back inside now, for sure, with the monodrone at our aid. Okay, so the other three world marbles are still stuck in these columns of black ooze with their Saturn rings rotating around them. I guess we go this way. Oh, here we go. Yeah. All right. You powered up another door. So are we going to be facing the drill spider? Maybe not quite yet. Now what are you? Okay, you have released a floating yellow marble, but I don't know what that does for me. You two have released as well. Okay. Oh, now they're moving. So we would need the orange marble here. All the yellow marbles went up to the north. Let's see what I can learn about this. 
I'm not seeing anything of interest there yet. Okay. Another world pad. A location here. We can't bring a marble through. So... Hmm. We can exit, but then there's nothing to do, right? There's nothing here. Yeah, so we gotta go back in. That may come in handy later. Okay, the three yellow marbles have entered into, I don't know, po capacitors? They're powering up whatever this is, and it looks like we have a boss arena ahead of us, so I guess we're going to be fighting the drill spider now. Another power in whatever this is? Okay. <laughs> okay, so once again, the, uh... Once again, the, like, the pink stuff is hard to walk on. When I come underneath it, it, it raises up, but, like, my interaction button does nothing. Huh. Okay. Oh, I see. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. So while I'm while I'm here, I can f I can if I hold the button down, I can fly for a while. Okay. Let me fly through these, crack them open. Got it. I want to make sure I land on a clear space. And don't get trapped in the pink slime. Okay, so I've got four monodrones, which I'm guessing are going to crack this open for me. Yep, okay. All right. And there's the drill spider guy. Oh, and I don't have any clear spaces, so I'm stuck on the pink slowness. He destroys them. Okay. Now, what's that yellow bright spot over here? Is that powering me up even more so I can attack him? No. Oh, I see it. It. it I. When he, he he'll attack where I'm standing, so he's attacked himself onto the amber. He got locked in amber, and I think I could have attacked him there, or his leg that was stuck, maybe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So now I can attack that. That does damage to him? Yes, he lost a limb. Okay, or he got he got hurt. He's sending out a ring of danger. Which I probably need to fly over. Yep, okay. Now I need another amber glowing light to appear somewhere. There we go. Come on over here. Okay, second hit. Another ring of danger comes out. Oh, two at a time. A little reckless. Mm, yikes. Oh, that's not that's not looking good. Ah, I messed up. Dang it. All right, we're going to have to try that again. The rings the second ring threw me off. And, uh, I got trapped. Okay, we know what we need to do. Let's see if we can get him on take two. It's interesting that the housing device there acts kind of almost like a... Like a railgun. Come on over here, big boy. Okay, that's one hit. Yeah, he's using the rings quite a bit now. 
Uh, feels bad with the ring. Ooh, that was close. Okay, the ring doesn't hurt me. Just slows me down. I need to get over here to this one. Okay, come here. There we go, second hit. He's angered. light to spawn somewhere. There it is. Alright, come over here. There we go. That's the third hit. He's only got one leg left. yellow light to appear there's there we go and defeated very nice okay The fourth marble is now ours. I'm not sure what these symbols are. For some reason, I can't go back inside it right now. Uh, oh, I guess these are these are flying power pads. Do I want to go into the black diamonds or do I want to avoid them? Oh my. Not what I expected. I thought we would fly. But instead we're firing little... Energy beams. Okay. Well, I presume I do the same thing here. Okay. There were some black diamonds in the first world, I believe. So I'm not sure if that's something I need to go back to, or if it's a secret, or... If it's expected, you know what I mean? I guess we'll find out. Still can't go inside to retrieve the other three. And this has now lost its power, so I can't fire. So I guess we'll just take the the orb with us and start exploring again. Alright, another black diamond. They act as keyholes or switches that you can hit, I guess. Uh, Alright, so here's a puzzle. I probably have to bounce it off that, right? Yes. Okay. Uh, let's see. How are we going to do this one? Probably we move the panel? Yeah. Okay. Very nice. Huh. Okay, so this one is an on-off. So how would I... I bounce it? Is that over there? Yeah, I probably need to move this back now. And then bounce it off. So I have time. I think that's right. Yep, there we go. Onwards and upwards, ever forwards. No idea why, but there's nothing else to do, so that's what we do. And more mysterious black ooze. Okay. 
And there are the rings again. Oh, it's extracted the other three marbles. Okay. And now a giant crab has flown away from us. Goodbye forever? End of game? Why did I do all this? No explanation, no answer? Oh. Okay, I, once I picked it up, it started moving. <laughs> I was like, you just left with everything I spent, you know, the past six hours working towards. What am I supposed to do? So the lobster left. Leaving us with only the white marble. Uh... Okay... You're an auto fire? Okay. Oh, I see. Huh. I don't see anything else for these to hit. Like, if I were going to set up a pattern for it to, like, bounce two or three times and then hit something. I don't see anything else for it to do that with yet. So, I think I do get it, though. I think we need to trap a projectile inside the four so that we can move the source power up. So that's trapped inside now, right? Right, so now we can grab the power, the marble rather. Oh, I need to, I need it to be in the other state. I need one more shot. Okay. So now the problem is, what's the timing to release this? Right after that. And then run. Uh, can I get there? Nice. Okay, so that brings me up. And we're past here. Making progress. Very nice. Okay. Now... We go back down? I can't, I can't get over there from here, right? Yeah. No. All right. Ah, there's an entry here. Excellent. Interesting. Very cool. Moves a bit faster at this level. It's harder than it looks, actually. Is that the lobster that took our three things? Okay, I think we're taking them back. We're driving it forward? Weird. Man, this game is so strange. Oh, he, he's returning it. Okay. He's like, I'm sorry I stole your three. 
So like that energy shot that we shot him with, did that did he like that? Or he's like chastised by us and therefore returns one of the three? I'm not quite sure what to make of that. So white is traveling with us as we carry green forward. Green now apparently has some weird ability to shoot us into the sky? I don't know. Okay, white's locked. So the only thing we... No, it's not locked. Okay. So we could go into white, we could go into green, I'm guessing. Yeah. But I don't know what to do or where to go inside these. I think... I think we need to take white inside green because now that we have white, we can shoot, right? And I think there were some, some black diamonds in previous world marbles. So I think there must be one in here that we can we can do now to make something else happen. Let's look for a black diamond somewhere. All right, so green was water world. These guys are the stickies that steal mono drones. But I don't remember much beyond that. It's been a while since I've been here. I don't know where the black diamonds are. They've got to be around here somewhere, though. That has to be the reason we were given access. Okay, maybe I'll cross this bridge. Nope, nothing here. So if it's not this path, and there's nothing here. Ah, there we go. So I need a place to shoot that from. I need like a power source. I can't just shoot this wherever I want. I need something to stand on. Like, can I shoot it from here? No. Huh. Nothing there. Um, if I get close enough, I can't, I can't do anything with it. I can't cross this. Yeah, it's strange. It's like, you, yeah, like, I definitely knew that I needed to get back to the Black Diamond somehow, but I don't see a location for me to power up the white marble to shoot with, and there doesn't seem to be anything else to do here. So, maybe not yet? I might need to retrieve the orange sphere, because there's... Well, no, there's... Uh, I thought there was a crystal bridge somewhere. But, yeah. Huh. Okay, so coming into green world is not working. Maybe we explore a little bit more here. Ah, uh, we, can, we can traverse this. Oh, that... What did that do? Oh, interesting. It's shooting into the marble. So, like, does that manifest? It goes the wrong way. Ah, okay, hold on. So I want to put it on... Oh, I want to put it on the other side, but that's not good. Oh, wait, nope. This one doesn't have a shooter. These have the shooter things on them. Okay, so I can do this. And now when I come in here... It should shoot to the left and hit the diamond? Yes. Okay. Interesting. Very cool. All right. So we got another diamond over here that we could hit if we... Oh, if we retrieve the marble. Huh. Huh. So now if we come back in, now we've locked our starting point to that location. So now the, you know, now the shot comes out of here. Okay, I get it, I get it. So we move this around. 
Now we want it to shoot to the right, so we put it on the left bracket. Oh, that disappeared forever. I guess we're done with that. That's not... That's a little... Unfortunate feeling. But I guess we don't need it anymore. Okay. So, now we needed to hit this one. Was there one to the north? It didn't feel like it. I guess there was, yeah. Alright. Okay, more traversal. Very nice. So, if we had the green marble... But this is the green marble. So, how would we have the green marble inside itself to use those columns? Maybe there's a way to unlock the power without having the marble? That could be interesting. Yeah, it looks like we need the orange here. Can't get it yet. Because the lobster still has it. What the hell is this? Okay. Is that... Switching the course of the... It is switching the course, or the status of the, uh, the transition blocks. I don't know what else to call them. The elevators? The platforms? But I can't, I can't get into any of them now. Huh. Feels like I've done this too soon. Because there's no way for me to get into. Do I want to change how this works? Yeah, it feels like there's no, there's no, like I can't go back. There's no way for me to get inside any of these. What am I missing? Do I take this inside with me, perhaps, now? Does that do anything? Like, what does changing the direction do for me? Why is that helpful? Can't leave with this. Like, why would the direction matter? So it continually goes... So it doesn't matter where the portal is. It matters the orientation of the shooting device. It's always going to go to the right. From that location. So is there anything else that's changing... As a result of the orientation of the... The platform. From hitting this switch. Is there anything else that's changing that we can... Do something with? Or... Like, I can't, I can't get over there. I can't do anything with the changing platforms. I guess if they were... I guess I could shoot through them if they were transparent. That might be something to think about. So... Like, we'll turn the transparent, then we'll move it. And so now that's like going, that could go through that column. And then if we changed it to shooting down, 
it would shoot in this direction maybe maybe that's it maybe that's i'm not quite sure what but there's feels like there's something there let me move the shooting direction so that it's shooting down and then when they're transparent let's move you over here so now you're shooting down what does that do anything for me not that I can tell. What about if it was over on the other side? Would it do anything over there? So now it shoots down through this way. That doesn't appear to do anything for me either. Hmm. Maybe it's... Maybe it's time to go back inside the white marble instead of the green? Like, what happens if I put the green marble in one of the shooters? Does it shoot? It does nothing. Oh, wait a minute! Oh, I get it. I bet I bet these also transition when the in when the when the interior of the green world is transitioned. So we actually want to set it up to be shooting continuously and then come out, I think. Yes, okay. Did that did I see that before and just not register that it was happening? I must have come out and seen it and not realized it. Okay, alright, well. Such is life. Such is streamer blindness. Or YouTuber blindness. Okay. So here's a location we could shoot from if we had the white marble. Same with those two. Alright, so we lower this, and now we can bring this up with us. In fact, we can bring both world, our world marbles with us. I think we swap this out and then take a look at this. Is that going to do something that I can't see? No. Alright, what about you? Why can I shoot from here if there's nothing for me to shoot? I guess I can shoot inside the green marble, right? Maybe that'll do a thing. It does! Okay. So then I want to shoot and then rush. Did I miss? Now why is it... Oh, because it has to be from the top. And I can't get there fast enough. Okay, so that's part of the... part of the puzzle. We need to change... So now, wait a minute. If I'm gonna shoot from the right... Then... I'm a little bit confused here, hold on. So if I'm shooting from the right... It needs to be in one of these lower positions for it to work. But I'm gonna be shooting from the left, right? Correct? So if I'm shooting from the left... Then it should be like this. I think. So wait a minute, we come up here, swap these, shoot from the left, and then it transitions. Excellent. Okay. Now I should be able to get up here. Okay. All right. Now what are we doing? Big black hole of ooze? Why not?
Okay, so we need a marble here. We need the green marble here to power that. What else can we do? And go get the green marble. Excellent. Okie doke. I don't know what our end goal is. I don't know what our destination is. I'm not sure. I don't have a sense of how far through the game I am at all. Like, it could just go on like this forever. But... At some point, we need to have some kind of indication that we're getting near the end of the game, I would think. I just don't know. Okay, another... Huh. So, as soon as I shoot, they switch. And I think you're only allowed so many mistakes before you fall back down. So, I shoot north, and then I shoot... Okay, so they move to intercept where I'm going to shoot. Huh. It's the same one. Okay, alright. Now what? I don't know how these are going to rotate. I guess it doesn't matter. So is, is lobster, is lobster like challenging us, testing us? You must complete my puzzle in order to earn the power to shoot me in the nipple. Then I will give you another of the orbs I took. Okay, now it's a now it's a tennis volley for some reason. And I got killed. I guess my timing was off. So it's just before it arrives, so I need to hit it. Yes, you hit me very hard. Ooh, it hurts so good. That's the stuff. Thank you, Daddy. I will give you another world orb now. Yeah. Masochistic Lobster. That's that's the name of the episode, <laughs> for sure. That's for sure the name of the episode. Oh my goodness, what even is this game? <laughs> Alright, well... I guess we've got our third marble back. So there's only one left, right? The purple one? And that seems like an appropriately good place to take a break. So we'll stop here. <laughs> Having formally named uh, our current frenemy, the masochistic lobster, uh, we'll take a break and come back next time for more. That is going to be it for this time, however, so as usual, I would like to thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Uh, we're up to almost 1,300 subscribers. Things have really slowed down in terms of subscriber growth, so if you're watching this and you haven't subscribed and you'd like to, uh, I would appreciate that. It makes me feel good when the numbers go up. But other than that, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one. Take care.